I gotta, you know, split the diff, right? What's up? Okay guys, so welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah and today I just wanted to show you a few of the things that I got over the last few months. They're all from Fabletics. That's kind of like a haul, I guess, and a little bit of a, a try on. Give you like my two cents about a few things, but most, Mother. okay, no, <laughs> show me here. Um, but mostly it's not necessarily like a haul for right now, but it's kind of more of a, <laughs> this is what happens mostly on <laughs> but she doesn't like jump up with her hind legs <laughs> I don't I don't get it I, I don't I don't know I gotta you know split the diff right anyways <laughs> Good grief, where were we? Okay, so it's not necessarily just like, oh, like a review try on type haul thing, but more of like goal clothes, like like goal, um, I'm not, I shouldn't say goal, like they're not end goal, but they'll just be kind of like little rewards for me along the way as I progress to lose my weight. And um, just, just they'll just be like new fun things that I can wear. But because stuff at Fabletics is sort of like limited edition on ev nearly everything, I saw things that I really, really liked. I knew I would want down the road, so I grabbed them now. That's what it is. Let's hop to it, right? So the first thing that I grabbed, well, let me just show you what I'm wearing. I've had these for a little while, but I do have the cute AF, which I don't really like the AF thing, but I like that it's cute and it's a tank. It is a muscle tank, so it has a really big um, side armpit, you know? Um, so it's definitely a workout tank like with a sports bra at the gym kind of thing yeah but I would just never wear it out with regular clothes I would always cover it up um, but I'm just putting it on for this video because it's all my fabletic stuff the other thing that I got and I think you can still get this is the sweatshirt and it has on the inside good like a drawstring that you can like pull tight I guess you would like maybe like tie a knot here to keep it cinched here but I don't like it to look like a jacket I just like it to be just normal long sweatshirt jacket super long sleeves and it has thumb holes so it is pretty tight through uh, the wrist here so like I have my Apple watch on underneath and it's kind of hard to get um, to be able to get my watch out for me to play with it basically right um so i have to like uh, to get it over like and like now it's kind of like catching see how it's pulling so that's the sweatshirt i really really like it it's got you know it's it's hooded like as you can see with the big old hood nice nice zipper nice long pockets so super super like it okay so the first pair of leggings that I got is the 7 8 length camo leggings and they are the high-waisted printed uh, oh, print. <laughs> the high-waisted camo 7 8 length power hold and um, so they are just still a smidge small for me so so as I progress you know I will get to enjoy wearing these and I'll get to enjoy wearing them longer if, as opposed to if I got them to fit me now then they wouldn't fit me for as long they would get too big too soon whereas like I think even like when I get down more to my goal weight I'll probably still be able to wear these so yeah so they're a size large I got those don't touch those Shiloh Okay, and then the other thing that I got, it's actually a little, I got a little outfit. I got the sports bra in the pink camo. It is the Kessler, and it's a medium impact sports bra. I tried it on, I, um, it's, I got it in, oh yeah, this is an extra large, and it, it does fit me right now, um, and it is definitely, medium support so this will be like for casual wearing or if I do a workout that's light lifting only because if I'm doing any sort of up and down this would never be enough for me um, and it does have yeah it does have removable pads so you can remove those when you wash it so I do like the detail of the straps in the back right here 
I probably will shrink down to a large when I get rid of more of my weight, but I just thought that it would be nicer to be able to wear it sooner and it's I'm not something I'm going to be relying on to really hold me down forever, so it being bigger will be okay. It'll still hold me well enough. And then I got the pants to match. Um, these don't quite fit. I tried trying them on, but they were not quite there for me yet. Pink camo, they are, I think, what, these are seven eighths as well. Yeah, these are the Kessler High Waisted Strappy seven eighths. These also have an internal little pocket, like for your key or it's usually like a house key type of a pocket. It's really tiny, one of those. So, which means it's kind of like a runner's type of pant legging. The other thing, whoops. The other thing that I got are these, I don't even know if you call these cheetah or leopard print. Um, but these are, let's see, these are high-waisted. These must, I think these are, I think these are a full length legging and they're kind of like a leopard, like a black and gray leopard print. They have the side pocket. Yeah, neither one of those did. Um, they have the side pocket. There is on the inside here, there is a little string to like cinch it tight, tighter if you want, because these are like, high waisted okay in the the leg there is a mesh detail and they're really wicking so they'll be good for running they're called the ultra cool when you see me wearing these when i'm working out you know that i have definitely lost some weight <laughs> and then i got runner pants in navy blue i just wanted to have like some variety you know these have a side pocket as well for your phone and they are yeah these are like mesh all the way down the side, so like the outside of your leg. Not that see-through, actually. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, not that see-through. So, and these are power hold, I believe, as well. I've been, yeah, these are power hold, and they're size large, and I believe these were seven eighths length. It might seem kind of crazy to uh, get like this many, um, that I don't, I can't wear yet, but I just thought that it kind of made more sense to get, you know, kind of like gold stuff, stuff that I'll get to enjoy, like being able to wear more of and have a little bit of variety. So yeah, I don't know. That's what I think. I'll actually show you too. I tried on for you the black Zoe, I think I guess I'd call it the original sports bra, high impact sports bra. It is the only high impact sports bra that Fabletics has made that I would even, I would wear. It's still not the best high impact sports bra that I own. Um, it doesn't beat my Victoria's Secret ones, but it's decent enough that I will be able to jog in it. I do like that it has a front closure. Yeah, I mean, it's just, it's really snug. It works really well. It's got like the nice little detail in the front. It's just kind of like something fun to make you feel cute, you know? I mean, that's basically what it is, right? Cause I ain't wearing it for anyone else. And then this is the other high impact one that I was gonna try. I tried, it. there's no way I was wearing it for you, but it. this is the Zoe 3 um, and it has, it's the one where it has the mesh in the middle here. And then it is a, and it has, it's either, what's cool why I was interested in this is because it's convertible. So these straps are act like a strapless bra where you can move them from, you can take the hooks and move them from being crisscrossed to just being straight, like a regular tank top. And it's nice that it's like rose gold, but I tried it on. No, no, not high impact. <laughs> not high impact like its earlier sister. Uh, no. Maybe high impact for someone much smaller, or smaller boobies. So she's gonna go back and it doesn't matter what size like this is actually a large and I tried it on it was too small I got it on it was fine but um, it's not my size for now but there ain't no way that I'm gonna try to actually run jog I don't run I jog a jog in this mm -mm. no no I guess I got this thinking that these were gonna go together yeah yeah they go together well enough I could wear the cute camo bra with these pants so it's just they just have this cute little detail in the back I guess supposedly this is, it's a big enough pocket that you could like put your phone or something. Um, but I think these are capris, which is like 
I'm not really sure. They're power hold. Oh, it says it's the seven eighth length. High rise with slimming power mesh lining. So yeah, those, so those are supposed to be power hold. So keep the tummy tucked in. And it's nice and it has kind of like the heart, the sweetheart booty but they're just a they're just basic like they're not particularly like sweat wicking they're more of that kind of flocked like fabricy material versus the really slick back stuff like the leopard printed one okay and then i got a pair of the seamless ones and it's the ones that have these have been out for a little while but they have the laser there we go so they have that laser like cut out there and then here I don't know what to, I don't know what to think about the seamless. Also, like what this laser mesh area feels like against the skin. I think it'll be okay. I don't know. Maybe I'll keep these. Okay, and then for the last thing that I got, I got a pair of shoes. I'm so like obsessed with for workout shoes, getting uh, like color blocks. And I really like white shoes or, you know, or something light colored. These are the Palms Performance Sneaker. And so they are mostly white, as you can see, with the color blocked heel and the black interior. They are super sweet. It's interesting, right here is like, it's plasticky. Um, even the tongue is this like really light plastic type material so yeah so they're just gonna be like either an athleisure shoe or maybe i'll be able to work out in them i'm not totally sure we will see i'll have to give them a little try but we'll see how that goes so anyways that is everything that i got again these are just sort of like goal or like rewards for me like as i continue just to go down the right path of like fixing my habits and issues relationships with food all that and the reason that i did that is because in the past i've been really bad about rewarding myself basically i just make these big lofty rewards and they're only allowed like when i hit like these really big goals or something or i hit big goals and then i don't reward myself properly and then when things you know stop going or whatever that i basically punish myself by not allowing me to have had any rewards so i'm trying this time just to go about it in a more positive aspect it's something that i've been kind of learning through that um noom app that i've been using so that is gonna be it for today i hope you enjoyed the video if so make sure that you go down there and hit the like button let me know also make sure you subscribe so you never miss any videos that way you get and the, if you ring that bell then you'll get notified as well so i think that's it <laughs> all right guys until next time stay blessed stay well bye bye